If every living creature on Earth descended from one species that could perform life's basic functions, replication, metabolism, etc., then not only should we inherit those functional capabilities, but we should also inherit the structures used to perform these functions. So a testable prediction of the idea of common descent is that all life should have similar structures that execute life's basic processes. And they do. Down past the cellular level and down to the molecules that support life's processes. All life on Earth shares the same molecules that allow life to function. Regardless of species, the polynucleotides, like DNA and RNA, polypeptides, like proteins, and polysaccharides, like starches and glucose, are identical. DNA, RNA, and proteins all have the same chemical form in spite of the fact that there are dozens of possibilities that would work. All life uses the same four molecules, adenine, cytosine, thymine, guanine, in the DNA ladder, although there are more than a hundred that could be used. All life bases its replication on the duplication of the DNA molecule. The proteins found in all life on Earth use the same 20 amino acids in their makeup, while there are almost 400 that could have been used. All life on Earth shares the same universal genetic code built into its DNA. The letters on the DNA ladder, taken three at a time, form coded instructions as to which amino acids should be joined together to form a protein. Every species on Earth uses the identical code to perform this function. Bacteria uses exactly the same code for making proteins that humans do. All life on Earth shares the same metabolic pathways. In all life, based on cells with a nucleus, from amoebas to blue whales, glucose is metabolized in the same 10 steps, in the same order, using the same 10 enzymes. Thousands of new species are discovered yearly and have their DNA proteins sequenced examined. Nearly 50 million new bases are sequenced every day and everyone is tested of the theory of common descent. It passes every test. There are enough different possible genetic codes, all functionally equivalent, and all using the same amino acids, for every species that has ever lived to have its own unique code. If there were no common ancestor from whom all life inherited this code, it would make sense to expect a wide variety of codes. This would protect each species from interspecies viral infections. The lack of variety indicates common origin. 